And with many predicting the writing was on the wall as far as his cup aspirations went, Robson himself would have agreed Chelsea were favourites to win this one. It was all end-to-end -end in the early stages. Speed first got himself in a good position, but his shot lacked accuracy. Then George Weyer had the ball in the Newcastle net. Offside given, though, the decision was right. It was Chelsea, though, who took the lead. It was simple touch football. Poyet saw the opportunity, and the execution was perfect. Barton had space to do something better with this effort. And after that early goal was conceded, Newcastle then suffered a further blow when Duncan Ferguson had to come off with an ankle injury. Newcastle's best chance of the first half came just before the interval. Solano with a snapshot. Again, it was off target. Chelsea were just about shading it. Newcastle came out fighting after the break. Shearer got the measure of Leboeuf. His cross was perfect, and so was Rob Lee's header. It really was classic wing play by the big number nine, and what a finish. Bobby Robson has really put the backbone back into his side. Tensions are running high. Poye claimed he was pushed in the box. He got involved in a scuffle with Howie. Both players escaped a caution. It seemed a safe bet that Newcastle could at least take the game to extra time. When Harley swung over a sweet cross, Poye seized the moment to head Chelsea into the lead again. Newcastle really had a mountain to climb. The last throw of the dice came when Dyer found space in the box. Again, De Hoy did his job perfectly. Chelsea then threw to the final. It's heartbreak for Newcastle. They had their chances, but Gianluca Vialli's side again showed just why they're so good at the moment.